Uh, kia ora guys, I just saw this through my um, office window and wanted to show you. Um, so the poles, the posts have gone up of the canopy and if you see right now, one of the cross beams is going down as well. Where does that look fantastic? Pretty amazing stuff. Look, I'll try, I'll try and keep you updated as it happens because um, I think it's quite interesting for a lot of us to see how these things are built. Here's a Lego story writing challenge. Have a go at making your own Lego model, then write a story about it. Here's one that I've created. Thief. Dotty from Dotty's Donuts had been rushed off her feet all morning. She hadn't even had a chance to put her feet up and enjoy a nice cup of tea because she'd been so busy making donuts for all the home deliveries. Donuts were in demand more than usual due to the lockdown and everyone wanting a sweet treat. So when Dotty had finally made enough donuts for all her orders, she poured herself a drink and went to sit outside. She sat outside enjoying her cup of tea and a cookie talking to her friend Sergeant Stripe. But while she was enjoying her tea, Roger the Dodger snuck up to her shop. He saw that she was busy chatting outside and wasn't in her shop, so he crept inside. He used his donut stealing rod to reach in and grab some donuts. Just as he was sneaking away from the shop. That's my donut! Stop! Thief! Help! 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 Stop! Constable Cam and Constable Clark heard the shouting and rushed out from the police station. Sergeant Stripe, Constable Cam and Constable Clark chased after Roger the Dodger. They quickly caught and arrested him. Constable Cam placed Roger the Dodger in handcuffs, then took him into the station. Roger the Dodger was put in jail as they had finally caught the donut thief who had been stealing donuts all over the city ever since the lockdown had begun. Dottie made a police report and was so happy the donut thief had finally been caught. I can't wait to see your Lego models and your Lego stories. Today, we are in the continent of Forest Hill and a few hours ago, I just set up this bird feeder to try and catch some of New Zealand's most common birds. I haven't seen any yet, but I do know that we will find some. Today, we might find some of the common birds from around here. We might see sparrows or blackbirds. Some, here's some amazing facts about them. Sparrows are a small sing-song bird species and brown and gray. And they love seeds and insects. And blackbirds. Farmers don't like these birds at all as they go and wreck and pick at all their crops. They also love Weeds, grains, and fruit. Isn't that spectacular? Well, that's all for today, guys. I need to carry on with my work and catch some of these amazing birds. 